Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. I just got this box today and I'm going to open it for y'all. I have a, I'm like, my heart is pounding. I have an idea of what this might be because someone reached out to me on Instagram and told me something, but I don't, I haven't allowed myself to believe it could even be possible. Um, but now it's here. So let's, Let's open it and let's have a look and let's let's see what it is. Um, I'm leaving to go out of town this week and it's arrived today, like just in time. So I'm 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 mild, I'm, I'm freaking out honestly. Like, uh, <laughs> wow. Okay, let's see. All right, here's something taped to the front. And it says, uh, oh my gosh. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, there is a letter <laughs> in here that says, um, all right, I'm gonna read it to y'all. <laughs> wow. This is gonna sound, this is a this is a print screen of email. This is gonna sound a bit odd and it's not something I've done before, but I'm hoping it will be okay with you. If this full set gets sent to Allison Hernandez of Muñecas Perfez and Dolls. I follow her on Instagram and her YouTube villa, vi videos and I'm on her Patreon site too. I've seen from watching her posts and videos that she has been desperately wanting a Blue Blood full set for a long time. I've seen her reaction to you listening to <laughs> Do you listen the blue caterpillar on Instagram? My heart melted when she said she may not be able to try for this full set. And so with an amazingly understanding husband, the bill payer, we bought the full set hoping that you may be able to send it to Allison as a gift from us. I don't know Allison at all apart from seeing her posts and videos. But from what I'm, I don't think I can read this. From what I've seen, she's a wonderful credit to the doll community. I thoroughly enjoyed watching her visit Pasha and tour the studio they did together. It's an extremely unusual and much valued insight into where Pasha and the Pasha Pasha family work. Please pass on my thanks to Pasha for making this happen. Allison kept my spirits up throughout COVID lockdown by having regular videos to watch. She has a childlike enthusiasm for dolls, which is rare to see and is very endearing. I love my Pasha Pasha full sets. There isn't a day that goes by I don't stop to admire the genius that it must have taken to create them. I can't imagine my life now without these sculptures to bring me joy and it's probably all down to Allison that I found Pasha Pasha. This, she showed off her dolls and that's how I discovered the amazingly talented Pasha. This is what it feels right to do and buying a thank you doll for her. I've never sent her any messages. So I'm happy for you to forward this email to her. She's curious to know why I'm doing this. I realize it's a bit weird but I don't think I'm conventional in a lot of things. I do. I'm assuming you already have Allison's address. Oh my gosh, y'all. <laughs> wow. Like, wow. Oh, I'll probably have to edit all that out. But anyway, oh my gosh. I, I don't even, I don't even know what to say. Like this is, this is so, wow. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow. Like, wow. All right. The, the, so somebody did reach out to me on Instagram and kind of told me about this, but wants to remain totally anonymous. So I just have to say like, I, there's not enough words of gratitude. Like it's not even the gift that's that, you know, that my videos mean so much to somebody that, that they would want you know, to make, like, this is fairy godmother level stuff right here, like, that somebody would, would want to do this for me, like, I can't even, I can't believe somebody would <laughs> like me enough to do that, I don't like myself this much, you know, like, oh my gosh, like, wow, okay, oh, let's open it, let's actually open it, all right, so, I'm probably gonna start crying again, I'm sorry, y'all, okay, 
These must be the mushrooms, because if you saw this full set, there's these beautiful mushroom display pieces um, that came with her. And like, I, it's just, it's so incredible because this, okay, so this, when, when Pasha first announced that she was doing a, um, doing an Alice in Wonderland set, I was like, I, I commented, I was like, it would be amazing if you do a blue blood caterpillar, like, absolutely amazing. And I'm like, and she, and she did it, y'all. And like, it's just, it's so incredible. It's one of the most beautiful dolls I've ever seen in my life. Oh my gosh, look at this. Wow. So this is, this is one of the bases and it's totally, look at all the jewels and gems on this. This is amazing. I love it. It is so luxe. Oh my gosh. Like I can't, I can't, wow. Wow, 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 wow. This is fit for a queen. All right, let me put this to the side. Oh man. Okay. Let's see. Wow. I can't believe this. I really can't believe it, y'all. I wanted this doll so bad. Like, if you follow me on Instagram, you probably saw, like, when I saw Pasha post this doll, like, I knew I wasn't going to be able to afford it right now. And so, like, I tried to put a bunch of dolls up for sale, and they weren't really moving, and it was kind of stressing me out. Like, and so I was like, well, you know, I'm just not going to be able to go for her, and maybe, you know, in the future, whoever buys her is going to share her a lot so that we can see her or maybe they'll sell her one day you know it happens every once in a while it's like if the doll is meant to be with me it'll be with me eventually <laughs> i didn't know it would be so i mean oh my gosh like wow 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 this is this is so wild like this is so i i can't i can't even fathom like I need, I want to, let's talk about Pasha's work. Let's talk about that. Okay. So here's the other mushroom display piece. Oh my gosh. This is so incredible. It is just so beautiful. Like, I just love it. Like how it's like upholstered. It's like an upholstery, like an upholstered mushroom. I watched this thing on Netflix the other day about, I forget what it was called. Fabulous fungi or something like that about mushrooms. It was really interesting. Um, so that kind of like, it's cool now that I know a little bit more about them and then getting this. Okay, all right. So we've got, okay, these are just, okay, those are just packaging pieces. Holy moly, y'all. I don't, wow. Okay, let me, this is one of the big boxes. I love these boxes because it has Pasha on the cover. How cool is that? Is that not amazing? All right, I'm going to put this down here. And then let's open this box. Oh my gosh, this doll. Like, okay, there's so much here to unpack. Oh, she's got her carrying case. Oh, wow. So the carrying case fits in here. Very nice. All right, that's still, oh, I think the doll might be in there. I was just shaking it like, okay, let's see. Um, oh, these are the, I think these are the bases for the mushrooms. I'm trying to save all my little Pasha Pasha stickers so I can put them somewhere. Um, all right. Oh, this is so cool. She put her, um, look at that. That's for the mushroom. Oh, this is so cool. Wow. That is, oh my gosh. Oh, wow. And so this screws into, let's see. Wow, wow. Talk about an amazing display piece. Wow, okay, let's see. Okay. 
This one has it too. I love that. Did I, are they the same size? They're not, this one's bigger. I wonder if the bigger one was supposed to go on the shorter, on the taller. I don't know. I can probably change it later. We'll just do this for now. Because I want to get to the doll. But I want to show you guys the whole package here. Like, when she, when she, okay, so I even told, I was, I, I was looking back through some of my old messages. I even told somebody, like, when Pasha started this line, I was like, if I have to sell a kidney when Pasha puts this doll out, and obviously that's just a, like, a turn of phrase that people say, like, they will do whatever they have to do. And it just, the timing was not right for me. I just couldn't do it. I, like, I can't believe, I can't believe this happened. Like, I can't believe I'm here opening her right now. It is totally unbelievable. Absolutely the most unbelievable thing. Like, I think this is her wig. Okay, let me get all her bits and pieces out. And then I'm gonna set the box to the side. I think that's everything out of here. I'm gonna put the tissue paper back in the box. All right, so we have some more room to work and I'm gonna sit down now because that was a ginormous box which we needed for how cool are those y'all that is so cool like it's amazing to me every set that Pasha does it's like she does something different to make it more like innovative and more um I don't know like the, to plus it up I always think of like the Walt Disney Imagineers where they always talk about they want to plus something up I think Pasha does that with every new doll she comes out with there's something that she's plussed up on her dolls like oh my gosh I can't I can't even believe this I cannot believe it I really can't this is I can't <laughs> this is really happening oh my gosh okay Whew. all right so let's let's go right to the doll and then we'll go to all the other stuff y'all oh my gosh look at her oh my gosh she is so gorgeous the blue caterpillar i can't believe it i can't believe it i can't believe it oh my word oh my gosh y'all <sighs> she's so pretty I'm trying to stop crying I swear I am oh my gosh oh my gosh look at her oh this color is so beautiful you know what I don't think I don't even think when I was at her studio I saw a blue one in person this is the first blue one that I've held in my hands, for sure. I've never held a blue Pasha Pasha. The blue is so gorgeous. It is like a, you know what, I think I know why I like it so much. It's got like a hint of, it's got like a purple undertone, you know, like it's not, I mean, it's not purpley at all, but it's like a really, oh, wow. And her eyes, okay, okay. I don't know where to go next because this doll has blinking eyes like I have to show you all that but I have to I want to get her wig I want to get her hands her feet let's set her on her <sighs> how does this even happen oh my gosh I can't I can't believe it she y'all she is so beautiful oh my goodness okay let's see um all right Pulling out all her bits and pieces. I think this is the strap. There is, this is her strap for the carrying case. We've got her COA, let's take a look at that. I always love looking at Pasha's COAs because they're always so elegant. Look at that, there she is. So she is a Pulse Mod, Blue Caterpillar. I love, I have, I have a Pulse, I have the Simply Beautiful Pulse, so she doesn't have the teeth. Um, but this girl has like you can see her her teeth there in her head I love it I love dolls with teeth I think I've told y'all that a million times um, okay let's see all right so just I mean I'm just looking like at her outfit now like okay so she's got 
you know, Pasha started making lingerie for her dolls. I love the way that she does the shapes on the lingerie and I love the embellishments she adds. Like I love the little sun embellishments. That goes perfectly with the caterpillar. Like I think that's the perfect decoration for this doll. It is so amazing. And then these, I love how they, she's got this like, oh, this is two pieces. I was thinking it was one piece, but I think, yep, this is two pieces. So this part, is different from the bottom part and then this has like these move it's like a little um, belt where those things move how cool is that I wonder if that's supposed to be like butterfly wings maybe so maybe that's like the idea here is that you know because the caterpillar eventually turns into the butterfly oh my gosh mm, okay so let's see what's in these boxes oh this is my makeup for play look at that so remove with sensitive skin makeup remover, then wipe softly with baby wipes and hand sanitizer. For crevices, you use a clean art brush. So I've got an eyeshadow base that helps adhere the makeup to the eyes. We've got some lipstick and blush. Do not leave on for more than two hours. So these are fun to put on for like photo shoots. Um, but then, you know, you would want to remove it. And then eyeshadow, we've got a gold and a teal eyeshadow. Loads of brushes in there to play with. So I'll have to play with her and show you guys like the makeup. That's, I've said it before, that's what I love about Posh stuff. These are high art pieces. Like this, this doll is worth every penny and more. Like this is a serious piece of art. You know, my, like my husband and I, like he can appreciate the artistry behind it and, and says kind of the same thing. Like these are super high art pieces, but they're not just to be hung on a wall or just put on display. Like you can actually play with her dolls. And that's what I love because as a, you know, doll collector that loves high art dolls, I love the, the being able to play with my dolls and interact with my dolls in a way that brings me joy. And that's her dolls like, you totally can do that with okay so these are um, stockings and I don't remember where this piece goes let me think maybe on her over her shoulders I don't remember for sure that can't be right I'll figure this out I don't want to put it on her wrongly and then wow 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 okay so then, are these hands and feet? These are hands and feet. Look, oh, I got extra hands with her. Yes, 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 yes. And flat and heeled feet. I'm gonna put on the, these hands. Oh, I wanna just show you, I love the hands of Pasha's dolls. Like, look at this. Look at the, you can see all the little veins in the hands. And for a blue resin, like the way that she's got it blushed and veined looks amazing. Just look at the inside of that hand. Love it. I love it. Wow. Okay, so let's put that on her hand. And let's do her other hand. I think I'm gonna, I think the shoes she came with are heeled shoes. So I think I'm gonna put her heeled feet on. I'll double check that. Let's see. Oh, look her magnet sticking. Oh those hands I love them I love having extra hands with a doll because it just kind of like you can do so many fun poses with them all right let's check the shoes by Ecolander and they are healed oh wow look at these these are little works of art um are they oh they're tied into the box they're jeweled wow and gold like this whole color palette or these blues, golds, and this neutral color, like the mushroom neutral color. These are gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Wow, okay. So we are gonna put our heeled feet on because these are high-heeled shoes. These are just stunning, absolutely stunning. All right, so let's do Ooh, they smell nice too. They have like a nice smell to them. Y'all probably think it's weird that I smell everything I get, but I love things that smell nice. <laughs> I love the smell of new things. Who doesn't? I guess there's people that don't, but I love the way new, new things smell. All right, so let's do these shoes and heels. This is surreal for me. I can't even believe I'm doing this right now. Like absolutely, completely, utterly surreal oh, 
<laughs> I'm going to be, this is my lunch break at work. I'm going to be useless for the rest of the day at my real job. Thank goodness I'm working from home today. Oh, okay. Give me your foot. Wow. Wow. Okay, let's put their shoes on. This is the right shoe. I'm gonna set her here so I can do this a little easier. There we go. Look at that. Wow, these shoes are gorgeous. Like, these are so luxurious. They're so, like, they're so incredible. Look, just look at those shoes. Look at how her feet look in those shoes. That is amazing. Like they look so good in these shoes. Like every part of this doll is so well thought out. Like every little piece and detail of this caterpillar. Oh, she's beautiful. She's so beautiful. All right, let me put her these things away so we don't lose them. And then let's look at her wig. This is by Anastasia. And I do love, like, she, I've, I've looked at her other blue full sets before, like the ones in the past, because, you know, you can go on her site and you can see um, past full sets that she does. And I love the blue ones with red hair. So when I saw this doll and that she had done her with a red wig, and I mean, I know a wig is changeable, but when I get the artist full set, it's hard for me to want to deviate from that too much just because it's such a special thing. Let's see. Look at that. Look at her. Oh my gosh. Oh, she is so stunning. This wig is amazing. Wow. Wow. I can't even like believe I'm sitting here with this doll in my hand. So gorgeous. So gorgeous. This hyper realistic face up on this blue blood is just incredible. I really just love like, oh, we got to look at her mod too. Okay. Let's, we'll hold that for just a minute. So let's see what is in the other, I think her, cause she came with a hookah. Cause that was one thing I said, like I actually commented on Posh's thing. Like if you do a blue blood caterpillar with a hookah, like I am dead. Like that is, that is like, that was what I was wanting to see her do in this collection. And, um, oh, a little fur. I forgot. She's got this little fur. Um, she's got a little fur stall. So we'll put that there. Um, I was really wanting to see her do that. And then when she did it, I was like, oh my gosh, like this doll is just such an incredible piece of art. I can't believe I'm so, I feel so honored to have her like in my home. Like, I can't believe that seriously, that this doll is actually in my, in my house right now. Like this is where she's going to live for the rest of my life. <laughs> She'll probably last longer than me, but we'll have to find, oh my goodness. So we've got, okay, look at her. I'm trying to figure out like, okay. This is so amazing. And she's got her little like, and she can hold it. Look at, even this thing is like jeweled. Like look at how Posh has added the embellishments and the jewels to this. Like, wow, it's just, let's see, will it fit in that hand? It does. Look at her. Because the blue caterpillar, if you know, is just puff puff all day long. There she, oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. This is so, she's such an incredible work of art, y'all. Like, whoa, wow. All right, let's check out the eyes because the eyes open and close. So I wanna see how that works. Pasha's shown it in a video on her Instagram and like she made a mod to her so she could do this. So let's see kind of how that works. So we've got, I'm gonna take her face plate off and let's see does it just oh so there's a lever so look 
So Pasha put a lever in the back of the head. You can see that. And I can just move it and look. She, oh, look at that. That is incredible. Like if I move the lever, her eyes open and close. What? Whoa, wow. So it is like glittery and amazing, the eyelids. Check that out, y'all. That is so cool that Pasha did that. Like so cool. Wow, that's incredible. Oh, and she actually like added like so the, I think Pasha made these eyes and there's like actually like veining in the eyes. The camera, I bet the camera is not gonna pick that up, but the eyes actually have like realistic veining in the eyes themselves. Like, wow, that is so amazing. I love the blue eyelashes she uses too. Like they're so good. We had to take a break because we both had to go back to work. So I went and got myself cleaned up. I'm sorry you guys had to see me ugly cry like that, but was totally overcome with emotion. Still very emotional about the whole thing, but I composed myself a little bit. I did remember that this is her antenna, um, which I think is an ingenious way to do the antenna for the caterpillar with, um, with this like going together with her whole set. So I'm just like, oh y'all, she's so beautiful. I've been sitting and holding her at my work desk like ever since. Um, I opened her at lunch break and it's just like, wow, she's just so incredible. And I just, I don't know the words to say. There's not words to say how appreciative I am to be so lucky to have one of these ma masterpieces from Pasha. So to the anonymous collector that gifted this to me, just know from the bottom of my heart that I I'm so appreciative to you and I will, I mean, I will hold her in the utmost regard. She will have a happy home here for the rest of my life. And I just, I, there's not words to say thank you enough for something like this. Um, so, you know, I just, I'll just keep making videos and hopefully, you know, that, and I'll try to pay it forward as much as I can to other people. So just thank you so much. Like I, I am absolutely still in astonishment about this, but I wanted to show you guys too real quick, her little, um, I put her stockings on too, um, afterwards. Cause I realized I got so into it that I like didn't, um, put those on either. So just kind of show you guys some of, um, like this, the cat is here naturally. He um, likes to take part in things. So she is just amazing. This doll is so amazing. I, I can't, I can't, I cannot, I really cannot believe she's here at my home. Like I really can't believe that she's mine. And I, you know, again, I, I just, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. You guys will see her more in the future. Like she's just so stunningly incredible. I feel so lucky to have this gorgeous girl in my collection, especially like, <laughs> wow. Like, oh, okay. I'm sorry, my words are failing me. I, I don't even, I don't know what to say or how to say it. Thank you to Pasha for creating her and to Erica for all your help always with um, shipping everything and doing everything and thank you very much to the anonymous collector for this incredible gift and this incredible opportunity to share her with the world and you know to have her here um, with my other Pasha dolls like she's just so incredible y'all so incredible just look at her okay I think I'll leave it at that um, you know I just I don't know what else to say. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed and we will see you in the next video. Bye bye.
I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from Patreon. Lindsay S, Leah W, Doreen Z, Janice H, Mercedes W, Cindy K, Bear Sunflower, Diane B, Kelly L, Cindy L, Susie W, Krista R, Victory Run, Shorna R, Shower Star Hobby, Stephanie W, Jessica S, and Ray M. Your support means so much to me and helps me continue bringing you great Dolly content. For more information on how you can become a supporter of this channel, click the link in the video description. Thank you so much for watching.